guys, welcome back. Hope you're all doing really, really well. So in today's video, it's been a while, but I'm finally doing the room reveal. Sorry if you can't see my actual eyes, by the way, that's just the lighting through my glasses. But yeah, anyway, finally doing the game and slash office room reveal. It's been ages to be fair, I've been ill, I had a chest infection, then I had my wisdom tooth fight, I had an abscess, all that stuff went off. So yeah, it's been a while. I think I'm gonna show you one half first and then the other half that you can actually see behind me now and show you that one after. But like the dynamic of the room is that half of it is supposed to be for YouTube, well kind of like a third of it and the rest is for streaming because I don't know if I've mentioned yet but I'm going to be streaming on Twitch quite a lot. So I'll leave my name for Twitch, it's just Ali Olsen, it's just here. If you want to go follow me, I would really appreciate that. And I'll show you the kind of YouTube side first and then the stream inside after, which you've already had a sneak peek at. Look at all this in the... No. <laughs> no. And then this behind me shelves and like I can still have my drawers, yeah. the Akana, and then my shelves on there. Bring in your drawers and stuff first and then yeah. do the wall stuff. So oh yeah, know exactly yeah. How this get the like four it. pond sort of thing. Yeah. I'm not even filming my neck. Oh my god. Yeah, my chin. Thanks for that. So we're getting me now. Alex drawers in there, yeah? Yeah. Oh god. Oh my god. I can't. I actually can't. Really? Yeah. You said that I was always too surprised. <laughs> oh. So it's not just me being weak then. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so this is going to be my YouTube bit. Backdrop there. I don't actually know whether my mirror's going to go there or there yet. I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. I've got some like white... <laughs> don't like background noise. Um, so I've got like two smaller white shelves to go there. And then... This is the wall where my backdrop's going to be for my streaming. Rug's going to go down here. Yeah, that's pretty much it so far. Oh, I got it from Wayfair. It's the first time I've actually ordered anything off it. Yeah, well, they folded it the other way around. So. It's nice. Oh, so it's going to curl up. Yeah. Do you want to bring it in? Put it down really gracefully. Oh, that looks cute though. There you go. Doesn't it? It's just this part. Do you think it looks nice though? Yeah, no, it does look nice. Oh, it looks right cute, doesn't it? Are you jealous? not straight in this house at all. That's fine. I mean, you're going to walk in that way and you're not really going to see it. And things are, like I said, you can put a wire down there. Yeah. I've got a little neon sign, so. Yay. Got first one up. What? Can I put this? I said, I got, I said you got first one up. You have the first one. Just make sure it works. Yeah. <laughs> this morning there was going to my way here, wasn't it? 
Det er småt, der er jo stået her, ja? Ja, hvorfor er jeg? So that's the landing, it's really small. Um, these doors we've actually put on recently, they still need planning, sorry I can't really see, they still need planning down and painting so please ignore any marks on them, obviously they're not stained like that. Um, yeah, the doors are on. I just need to put some little handles on as well when I painted them. So yeah, I'll kind of show you from where we like walk in and stuff. So when you walk in, obviously you come from here. Got a little rug on the floor that I got from Wayfair. Do you want my little socks by the way? Mike got me these from... In fact, I don't even know where they're from. They're like an early Christmas present. Yeah, that's my kind of like YouTube area. I'll show you with the lights off as well, obviously. How pretty that is. That's it. At night time. Obviously my screen's lit up as well. So it's not quite as dark as it is right now. I just thought that looks so cute. I think my batteries are going to these lights as well. But these lights are actually garden lights that I got again from Amazon. I'll link everything down below. Um, this was from Ikea. So we've just got a little plant there. We've got a candle from Primark. They've got a candle there. It's not a Yankee candle but it does smell really nice. It's just, I can't even pronounce what it is. Cinnamon and apple I think. And then I just got this small tin from um, Ikea. I haven't actually got anything in it yet. Got my little Christmas tree there from also from Ikea. It, do you know what no one tells you as well? That these are the spikiest little things ever. They've been dropping all over here and I'm trying to keep these baubles on them and I'm struggling so much. But yeah, every time I put them on, they just this one looks a little bit sad. Just dangling down its own. But yeah, I've been trying to keep them on and it just keeps falling off, so as you can tell. I've got four there that have fell off. Next we've got like a wax burner that a minute has got the baubles in that have fell down. A little tea light in there. I've not actually used this before. Then we've got this little owl that my sister crocheted. How cute is that? Another candle from Primark that's actually got old Yankee candle inside it, still not burnt. This is also from Amazon. This stag here is from Home Bargains. Oh, Home Bargains or oh, the range I think. I can't really remember. But yeah, my mum got it for my wallet. It's just so cute. So, only thing is it's got glitter everywhere and it got, like, you literally get it all over your fingers. But yeah. So I've got two plaques here that my mum got me as well. And then I got that from Home Bargains ages ago, I think. And then on my desk, we have my Apple Mac. Obviously this is the cover, you can see. I got from Amazon as well, I just live on Amazon. Keyboard, Magic Mouse, and normal mouse. Again, Ikea, it, sorry, not Ikea. This is also from Amazon. This is Ikea though. It's just like a table, I've completely forgot what you call it now, but that is, what's that from? 
range, I think. And then obviously Amazon again. When I got it, I thought this pillow would be really small, like half the size, which I was actually like fond of. But it arrived and it's massive, which is not bad for six pounds, but yeah, it's just huge. So we've got there, and then we've got this little rug here. That's my light. Oh, when you're walking as well, you've got Rex just sat there because he's absolutely huge. But the last thing we've got is so on this kind of like YouTube side, like I said, um, I've got some Alex drawers, which has got like homeware stuff in, electrical stuff. That's actually got my Xbox in it because I can't go up in it, can't get it out. In here, yeah, I've got like, I'm doing this cross stitch as well on my wall. That is so like janky, but you'll work out soon. But yeah, got all this stuff for me, me and my mum. So that's pretty much the kind of YouTube side of the room done. Um, so now I'll show you the gaming side. So again, when you walk in, this is what you see. Here another bit. Oh, I didn't show you my canvas as well. That canvas is from TK Maxx Home. I think it was about 50, 60 pounds, but I absolutely love it. And I don't know if you can see too well. And the light is like, I don't know, it's textured, so it looks like oil paintings. Really nice. Um, and then the shelves themselves are from Ikea as well. On this side is a little sticker. It's quite textured, so I just ignore that. I've got the dress apart plaque and little collector's coin that Mike got me. And then this, if anyone remembers this game from PS1, let me know. It was such a good game. And then I've got like pop figures, Toy Story things, plushies up there. <laughs> That's a money box. So I've got some Pokemon cards there, I've got some cans. So I've got this as well, which is an original Gengar sticker. Pogs, I don't know if you can see them there. These three there. Snowball's my favourite. These are like all originals as well. A Godzilla puppet that I had as a kid. I'll do another video with every like retro toys and stuff and probably go into detail with it. Um, but for this video I just want to sh generally show you what I've got. can't show you what's on the top because that's not for YouTube. It's a little bit rude. So, <laughs> But yeah, my friend from work gave me this, what she had. And I bought this from a um, retro game market. And then Mike gave me that one. Still need to hide like wires and stuff because that's for this. But yeah, got me Build a Bear Snowball there. Got me Mimikyu, me Mini Butterfree. Got me Rex there, looking happy as ever. Where is it? There you go. Talking Pikachu again from my sister actually gave me this one, but this is still from um, Build a Bear as well. This I got from a retro game market. This is a Disney Showcase collector's item, which is Minnie and Mickey. Then I got Marie there, because I love Marie. Aristocats is like one of my favourite films. This dinosaur is an absolute pain to put on. I actually got him from like a antique shop near my work. And one of my work colleagues actually saw it and said, oh my god, this, you know, this T-Rex is like hung on the outside of the building. So I was like, what? I need to go and have a look. Saw it, <laughs> and I'm sure it was like £50. Um, just fell in love with it, so I needed him. So he's quite big as well, like, it's my hand, it's pretty big. But yeah, the detail on him, he's got a couple of scuffs on him. Let me just focus this again. Yeah, he's got a couple of scuffs on him and stuff that I need to like touch up with some paint, but that's just because it's been stored. But yeah, in here I've just got some wax melts. Another dinosaur that might got me for Christmas. This is like a little, what are they called? Like, them iron beads or whatever. Aqua beads, I don't know what they're called. Got my Faber, a little Faber Faber, love that. Got a tattoo with this as well. So I've also got this mini games console as well with a game which I believe looks like, it's not focusing, but it looks like something like tennis or something where it's printed backwards, which is ridiculous because it cost me like a fiver. That's Pokemon Coaster that I got from Game, um, game Market as well. And then this is like a printed piece of wood. Godzilla, that my sister gave me that I think. Some little retro teeth, I used to have these as a kid. Go Halloween in way more time. 
and then like a little keyring in the back. This Pokeball that Mike got me when he was living in Wales. Got what shop he actually got me from, but it's got a little Raichu inside. Yeah, so next is this little egg, like resin egg Mike got me for Christmas. It's from, I think it's from like, is it Ben's workshop or something? I don't know, I'll leave it on screen now and link down below. Um, but yeah, it's like a resin egg and it's got like glitter inside it. I don't know how well it's actually focusing there, you can see the glitter in it. But it's like a landscape, it's got a little tree in the middle and that's like the earth I'm guessing. It's actually wood but... Um, it's really interesting actually, we used to watch him make these and I just fell in love with him so he actually got my one for Christmas so thank you Mike. These are Pokemon badges and they are not the right way up. So yeah, Pokemon badges and then Slinky Slinky, that's another retro one and then one that's, this one's actually Mike's but he let me have it on my shelves. This is an original Woody, some little Mario printed wooden things again, like this Swirtle one that I showed you already. That is a new Tamagotchi that my sister got me for birthday one year. And then that is a present that I received from a tattoo client. But she made me like loads of different stuff, it's so good. This I bought off Amazon. And I'm sure it cost me like, i my phone. And I'm sure this cost me literally about £15. Maybe even 20 I don't know. Basically presses down and it's supposed to light up. I've actually not put batteries in it but how tiny it is. It's really small. I actually thought it was going to be a lot bigger than that. So then pop figures. I have Velociraptor, I've got Crush Bandicoot, I've got Dustin from Stranger Things because he's literally my favourite. This, I've got Bob Ross. My mum got me that for Christmas either last year or before. Angelica, Spike, obviously both from Rugrats, and then we've got Sarah and the Worm from Labyrinth. This is just from Primark, I think. Let me just show you the back. Oh, it's not going to light up, obviously, because of the um, softbox behind me, but yeah, that's what that looks like. Last but not least, on this shelf, we've got Spot the Dog. I've also got a tattoo of him. We've got Bob um, not Bubbles. We've got Buttercup from Powerpuff Girls, we've got Chucky, Angelica, their puppets, um, again their original like retro type toys, um, a little iguana that my niece got me for Seaside, from Seaside, and then we've got Bowser which is also from Build-A-Bear. And here is just like a little... So you've seen my shells, this is what it looks like as a whole, so I'll just show you there. I'll just show you what I've got underneath quickly and then I'll show you the PC and everything. You walk in this way, you see Rex, look how happy Rex looks. It looks, yeah, a little bit, looks a bit surprised. He is huge by the way, like, this is my leg and he is absolutely massive. I think my sister and my nephew gave me him. We've got some little trunks. In there there's like extra makeup and storage and stuff for brushes. Look my phone. So yeah, that's that. So we've just got some IKEA drawers there. This is where I keep all my makeup. I should have showed you this on the on the YouTube side actually, but I completely forgot. But yeah, on here, I've got all my makeup, all my sponges. I promise a lot of these are actually clean. They're just stained. But yeah, that's foundation, concealers, primers, stuff like that. Then got my blushes, eyebrow stuff, hair stuff. Highlighters, that's a blush that highlighters. Um, yeah, bronzers at the back. These are just palettes, and I've got too many of these. So these are all my lip stuff, which is very not that much. I need to fill all that. This is like my filming stuff, so like batteries, camera case, stuff like that. And then I've just randomly got a wireless mega drive in there as well. These things are for upcoming videos, so that's the drawers done. So then on the windowsill, some IKEA flowers, little money box there, another IKEA flowers. That's that massive hole that I showed during the renovation vlog as well, which you can see goes all the way there. It doesn't actually go down to like as deep as it looks to be fair, so I've filled it already but it's just kind of like not 
completely filled if that makes sense but i'm gonna get like a little radiator shelf or a cover or something to go over that um so yeah i've got this blind that's the same one as in the other room so it's just to match that so if i pull this out just got like my printer and laminator behind there some more alex drawers these are kind of like my junk alex drawers so i'm not going to show you inside there too much so here is my setup which looks very pretty this on it's on standby like i said i need something to go there and these stickers that go over that aren't actually meant to be there as you can see i just need to peel these off it says home um, but the obviously the four stickers like on the front and back of these just so they won't get ruined i've got a um, 31 inch curved monitor 27 inch straight or flat monitor got my xbox pad there ignore my wires as well i've put as much in to these organizers as i can but they are the ones that obviously i've got like a power surge thing there so i can't really do much else with them but my alexa's there a keyboard which I'll show you properly so you can see the back that's like a Yu-Gi-Oh mat just for the mouse mat which i really like so this is my stream deck why is it not focusing focus please there we go got my mouse overwatch mouse and then this little mouse mat it's a squidgy this is my headset as well Mike also got me this. It's got me a lot of things to be fair. So that's these. Again, I'm gonna go through everything in a separate video. But that's my Logitech webcam. It's a really, really good webcam actually. Um, and this is my PC. And then this is my chair. It's really, really comfortable. I actually ordered another one, which I said in another video that I'd ordered a big pink one, like an office chair type one. That one did actually arrive, but we had a massive cuff off all with that because it came from um, China, I think it were. It, yeah, it came from China and we had a massive deal with it because I paid like, I don't even know, a couple of hundred pounds for it and it just wasn't the quality that I thought it would be. Um, but I didn't know it was coming from China and I didn't know that it takes so long to come. All that lot so yeah i just ended up getting this one instead so it's so comfortable as well it's like really cushiony so yeah oh i nearly forgot i've got my mic as well that comes out on this little pivot thing and then if you loosen that goes up and down there and obviously you can tighten it again so that just stays there. I sometimes even like hang my headset off there if I'm like on it but not using it too much. So that's there. It's got like a little vice thing there. I think this was only off Amazon. A lot of things in here were from Amazon as well. This is an Ikea corner desk. The same as that one but just corner version. The same legs and everything. So again I'll leave it linked down below. These Alex straws came with that. I got this like a few years ago. I think that is pretty much everything. The only thing I showed you is my skincare, which I'll show you now. This should also have been on my YouTube a bit because this is where I get ready. Now uh, this is my like Hollywood style IKEA mirror. These were I'm sure these are like eighteen pound each, and then like the bulbs two pound. You don't get them with it. Mally, if you've not guessed already, is Mike and Ali together. So we've got some little candles from Mankind. They're all my brushes. This is from Ikea as well. This is also from Ikea, obviously I've got two. And these are all like my face and eye brushes. And this is my skincare that I just keep on top. This mirror we've had for absolute years and I just can't get rid of it. So yeah, this is my skincare, or some of it at least. Came out as well, so I'm not using that anymore. But these are literally like the best face masks ever with the Foreo UFO. So yeah, that's my skincare. Um, yeah, so the lighting's a little bit darker now because I've shut the doors, but this is, when it focuses, this is a full pan of the room. So it's very Christmassy. Eh? So that, like I said, it is a small room, but it's very spacious. Like, you're not without room, if that makes sense. So I can, like, do my holes there, do my makeup, put my, like, camera here or on the end of the table. That's made it in space. Love that. I just think it's like a really cosy space to be fair. It's just a chilled area. That's where the aliens are coming in, apparently. And then here is 
and I'm covering that up because that is literally just not for YouTube yeah that's what it looks like and then you go around there that's my monitors that's my setup you've got tons of floor space as well which I love I can't have a cramped room so I just quickly want to show you what it looked like in like kind of night time Daisies blooming, sundress swaying in the breeze. Oh, there are all my little glow in the dark stars. So when I'm sat editing, I can look up. It's kind of like a little starry night. See, like there's a few little bits that I still need to do, but yeah. You see the difference in the lighting when the softbox is not on? It's so yellow. Let's do the outro in the YouTube area, shall we? Oh, look at Christmas stuff. That's another thing that I wanted to tell you as well is obviously it's December now so I'm all better, not ill, fingers crossed I can actually start doing Christmassy type videos now like I said um, yesterday or day before was it I actually videoed a decluttering uh, video and like a little wrapping presents and stuff like that just like a cute chill video I'm not doing vlogmas but it's gonna kind of be sort of vlogmas but every few days if that makes sense so yeah I've got that to come got loads of plidios, loads, pl plidios, loads of videos planned so yeah I'm excited for the Christmas videos so yeah if you enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up comment down below what else you want to see me do in like the Christmassy type videos thank you for watching this video if you got this far please hit the subscribe button down below and help me get to 100 subscribers I know that's literally nothing for, for like a lot of people but it would mean a lot if I did get close to that. I hope you all have had a nice week of December, the first week, getting rid of Christmas and everything. So yeah, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.